This is really perfect timing because after a three year hiatus, this year's Great American Beer Festival in Denver was a success. The event brought in more than 500 breweries from across the country, 2,000 different beers to taste, and most importantly, 40,000 people over the last three days. And that means a lot of money for the Metro. Amy Wattis breaks down the economic impact. It was a packed house inside the Colorado Convention Center. The conversations were going, the beer was flowing, and the pretzel necklaces were everywhere to be seen. Brenton Gallas had enough pretzel necklaces for 16 people. So this is the first year back after COVID. This is 16 years I've been doing it. So it's something he couldn't miss. Denver is the Mecca. It's the Napa Valley of beer. So why would you not be here? A beer Mecca that the Brewers Association says brought in a lot of people. Well, when people come in for the festival, they're coming in from all over the country, from all over the world. Which means a lot of money for the local economy. It's estimated they're spending about $15.2 million while they were he they're here. They're spending that money in restaurants. They're spending that money shopping. They're staying in hotels. Staying in the metro and also trying out local breweries while they are in town, like our mutual friend brewery in Denver, which took home two medals tonight. Head brewer Jan Jankowski was wearing his gold and silver medal proudly when we talked to him. We won for uh, gold for Saison Tristero and Brett Beer and then Beer Ovale for mixed culture bread beer. And Karen Hertz, founder of the gluten-free brewery Holidayly Brewing in Golden, showing off her silver medal at GABF, a two-time cancer survivor who turned her struggles into success. I was told I needed to be gluten-free, but I love beer, and so I created a gluten-free brewery in 2016, and this year we won the silver for our Buckwit Belgian beer. A lot of hard work paying off and celebrating for these breweries until it's time to prepare for next year's GABF. The Brewers Association tells me next year's GABF will be even bigger and likely better than ever as the convention center will have even more space available for the events. Reporting in Denver, Amy Wattis, Denver 7.